I don't like progressives, liberals, you know what I mean? Ugh. If I date a white dude, I want to ruin your family, you know? <laughs> What's the point? I've lived amongst all types of whites. They tell you that they're all the same, but they're not. I've lived in the Midwest, those are cornfield whites. You know what I mean? Try to assimilate there. I went to, you know, rode on a pickup truck. I ate casseroles with Triscuits on it, shit like that. That's how I reach out of hand. You know what I mean? Went to a bonfire. I did. You know that shit is just a fire? Did you know that? I did not know that. I don't think black people know that it's just a fire. Like, I was so disappointed. I was like, I gotta get out of here. You know what I mean? So. Moved to the suburbs, right? Amongst the suburban whites. Those are my favorite kind of whites. Not to hang with, just to observe. And uh, when I first got up there, because it's very conservative up there. It was very conservative, it's very white, so I was like kind of nervous, because I was like, where the hell am I gonna get my weed from? You know what I mean? But uh, no problem. I met my neighbor, his name is Adam. Adam the Republican, you know? I know that because he told me immediately, like a weirdo. And uh, one day, I'm in my house, I'm coming out of my house, Adam comes out of his house, wearing his cargo shorts, carrying an acoustic guitar, because he wanted to show me that he knows how to play Redemption Song by Bob Marley. True story, <laughs> true story. We had never talked about guitars, we had never talked about, my, about Bob Marley, but he was in his house like, you know who would enjoy this shit? <laughs> that black girl across the street, so. <laughs> comes over, he's singing it. I listen to like two verses, because I'm nice. <laughs> listen to, I'm just like, what, the, what, how's my life ended up here? Like, what did I do to deserve this shit? I listen to that shit, and I'm just looking like, God, this is such a weird scene. Like, this dude is so weird. <laughs> you know what? This motherfucker got weed. And the point is, <laughs> the point is, He's like my best friend right now, you know what I mean? We hang out. One day he called me up, he's like, Janelle, I got this vape machine. Do you want to try it? I said, hell yeah. Vaping in the burbs? I feel like I made it, you know what I mean? <laughs> That's what Martin Luther King was talking about. <laughs> Y'all remember that shit? I had a dream. Blacks and whites would come together vaping the burbs. <laughs> you remember that shit? Yeah. Gotta pay attention. Thank you guys for having me.